Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving headfirst into the hottest topic in F1 right now, the 2024 McLaren livery. Buckle up, because McLaren just dropped a papaya bomb, and we're about to dissect it piece by piece. First impressions. Wow, just wow, McLaren has truly outdone themselves this year. This livery is a perfect blend of classic papaya heritage, modern sleekness, and some sneaky nods to the past. It's instantly recognizable as a McLaren, yet it feels fresh and exciting. Key design elements. More papaya power. The iconic papaya orange takes center stage, covering a larger portion of the car compared to 2023. This is a clear statement of intent. McLaren is embracing its roots and going all in on its signature color. Anthracite accents. The dark anthracite grey provides a stunning contrast to the papaya and adds a touch of sophistication. It's not simply black it has a depth and shimmer that makes the car look even more menacing. Chrome comeback, remember those shiny chrome driver numbers from McLaren's golden era? They're back, baby. This subtle detail adds a touch of nostalgia and class. Stealth mode echoes. Keen-eyed fans might notice subtle hints of the popular OKX stealth mode livery from 2023. The gradient effect on the front wing and engine cover is a sneaky way to keep a bit of that fan favorite design alive. Hidden Easter Eggs McLaren loves its Easter eggs, and this year's livery is no exception. Look closely, and you might find the speedy kiwi, a tiny kiwi bird hidden somewhere on the car a tribute to Oscar Piastri's New Zealand roots. Driver initials, Lando and Oscar's initials subtly incorporated into the design, McLaren DNA, references to past iconic McLaren cars woven into the livery. I absolutely love this livery, it's bold, it's beautiful, and it perfectly captures the spirit of McLaren. It's a livery that screams confidence, a livery that says, we're back and we're here to fight. What do you guys think of the 2024 McLaren livery? Let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe for more F1 content. Thanks for watching, and until next time, keep it fast and furious.